Hey guys, so I am so excited because all of the holiday 2017 makeup palettes and brushes and everything is finally coming out. So I was actually just at MAC the other day picking up one of the lipsticks that I love, which I'm actually wearing. It's called Japanese Maple and it's another nude that I literally can't live without, but I saw all of their holiday products finally came out. So naturally I had to pick some up. Um, so the one that I am doing a tutorial on today is this gorgeous, silver snowball eyeshadow palette. They call it the Snowball Eye Compact Rose Gold, which obviously if you've looked at my blog or watched anything that I have been writing about on my Instagram, Rose Gold is my absolute favorite. So this retails for $29.50. Um, and let me show you what's inside. So first of all, brushes can be very expensive. And the thing that I love about this palette is it comes with a brush and not just any brush it comes with a two-headed brush and also if you've been watching any of my tutorials you know how obsessed I am with dual headed brushes I feel like they literally are the best thing ever you can throw one in when you travel and it's just amazing so um, let me talk a little bit about this brush um, I have not used this set at all, but you can see that one side would be great for blending and the other side is probably great um, for smudging and also just for your eyeshadow. So I cannot wait to use this brush. It's also kind of cool because it's like flat almost. See how it's like thin? So it's super unique, um, something different, easy to travel with, and I love that it's silver um, to match the outside of the palette. So let's talk about the good stuff. So the inside of this palette, oh my God, just look at it. I mean, literally you get every color you could ever need. So you have like an ivory, you have this gorgeous nude color, you have like almost like a, like a silver and they're so shimmery. Um, and then this rose gold, a burgundy, these are all the shimmers and then some matte colors um, and another dark, which this can be used as eyeliner. It could be used as just a dark smoky eye color but you have everything you need in one place so you can use this for more of a dramatic look or just a traditional everyday which is totally what I love versatility in palettes is amazing um, so yeah so I'm gonna do a tutorial on this today I'm going to post a product review on my blog which is always melissa.com and I will leave a link down below so that you can access the product review as well as this tutorial here so you can really get all in one. So anyway, if you're interested, please keep watching. Okay, so starting off, obviously the first thing that I always do is prime your lids. Okay, so now that your lids are primed, which will hold in all of the eyeshadow, I'm actually just going to start and coat my lids with this beautiful ivory color, and then I'm gonna go in with this second nude color and just coat my entire lid. And I'm using the side 546SE. Ooh, these shadows are soft. All right, guys, I'm gonna pin my hair back. Okay, so I'm going to now take that same nude color and I'm gonna use that as a transition color of my crease. Okay, so now that we've done the crease with the nude color, let's go in with this burgundy color. Oh my gosh, it is like so vibrant. Do not put too much on your lid, or excuse me, on your brush. We are going to have to blend, but it's really, really pretty. And I love that literally there's so much vibrancy to these colors. They're really intense. Let's blend. Oh, 
Okay, so now that we have blended it out a little bit, let's go in with this rose gold color. I'm dying to use it. So um, I'm gonna take the other side of the brush, the 547SE side, and I am just going to dip it into that color. I wonder if it comes off as easily as all the others. Um, oh yeah. It's a little more sheer than I thought it would be. Okay, so now that we did the top of our eyes, let's go in and do the bottom. So I am going to take the thin side of the brush, which is the 7SE side, and I think I'm gonna go in first with the nude color, and then I'm gonna go in with the brown color. Both of them are matte, and I really wanna use matte underneath my eyes, um, even though I'm obsessed with this rose gold color in here, but let's go in with those two colors, and then maybe next time we'll test something else out, so. And I'm taking that thinner side and starting here. And now going in with the brown. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is we are gonna go in with our eyeliner and our mascara. Don't forget to curl your lashes and I will show you the final look in just a moment. All right guys, so this is the final look using my new MAC Snowball Rose Gold Palette. I kind of wish the outside was rose gold, but I still love it, and I hope you do too. I'm actually pleasantly surprised by this. I've bought many palettes from uh, holiday collections that kind of I just let sit in my drawer, but I feel like I'm gonna use this one all the time, and the thing I love is you could do like a really dark, look uh, smoky, a little more vibrant like what I just did, or you could do something super natural. And you don't have to make it drastic with the liner like I do and with um, the mascara that I use. You could literally make this super natural or you could go all out and do a darker, awesome, um, smokier look. Um, the other thing I really, 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 really love is that it comes with a dual head brush. I feel like it was, it's a little smaller than like the blending brush I usually use, but the point is you can use it for anything and for like travel and for me I travel all the time for work so I would say like this is definitely a must-have for $29.50 I highly recommend it um, this is absolutely not a sponsored post by any means I bought this product with uh, my own money a few days ago and I really love it so I think that everyone should go out and get this palette it's a great deal it's versatile and year-round and um, I hope that you enjoyed this tutorial and if you want to see my full product review, definitely check out my blog, alwaysmelis.com. If you enjoyed this video, please thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thanks, guys.